Moshi Moshi, my gamers, and welcome back to Honkai Style Whale. What surprised you most is that your old friend Sampo, okay, maybe friends is a strong word, happens to be a pair of Coney too. Firefly doesn't seem to trust him very much, but the ever friendly and ugly as a dark blue gentleman wants to teach you all about the adult side of things in a legal way. Oh shit. Well, you're here now, so it couldn't hurt to try, right? Today, we are going to the adult side. I don't know what I'm gonna see what I'm doing. Okay, look at this. Don't worry. Shut up, Sampo! This isn't going to involve I don't anything trust illegal. you. Huh? Illegal? What is camp? So, like, that machine then? Woohoo! Watch the cars! Don't get ran over like last time! Uh, it takes a long time to reach the other side on foot. How about we just bounce over there using the pinball machine? Pinball machine? He is not fully acclimated to the dreamscape yet. This could get dangerous. Dangerous? Miss Firefly, we're in a beautiful dreamland crafted by the family. How could it be dangerous? This is the perfect place to have some thrills. Come on, pal. Show her what you're made of. Um, I guess we're gonna select the bow machine. Ah, click on the select the plate, expend energy to activate the plate, and close the plate to gain energy. When your plate is activated, you can set it to rotational directions. You cannot activate any more the plate when you do not have enough energy left. Click restart to restart your platform. Create a chatticle that connects the pinball launcher on both sides by activating closer or rotating the plates. When the chatticle is completed, you can launch the pinball to reach the destination. When you exit the machine, the current play setup will be saved. Okay, um... How to... Okay, there you go. Rotate that, and then... There you go. Oh, I'm feeling woozy after all that. Is this the lower level of the commercial district? Bingo! Our destination is right there. Peppy Papeshi Salon. Okay, I just took some money out of nowhere. We don't get free money this from that. This is no ordinary salon. The only guests allowed to enter are the Papeshi people. Or those with VIP cards. NPC could but dance spell in Genshin? What? difficult for... Sempo. Hmm, now you're done talking, okay. Huh. Um... Oh, what was that? I was listening. Here we got this. Boom. Don't hit me, Joe. What do you mean? But you have something in there! I want something inside of... Oh, inside your pee pee. There you go. Chub, what are you doing? It took me so long to find a way to find your friend my wings, Chub. This Chubby is amazing. It won't come down to fly into the sky. I don't have to use my any so much energy. Feel free, super comfy, Chub. Forget it. It's not a bad way on my own wings sometimes. Now you're popped. Thank you. Now we're talking to this child. Here we are again, pal. Huh? Oh, it's you. You here to relax? Right! I have two friends here who want to come with me. Any seats left inside? Mm. How many of you? Three. Three. Show me your VIP card. No problem. Here it is. I'm talking about your friends. I've already seen yours. Um, well, how can my friends have VIP cards when they've only just arrived? <laughs> can you make an exception and let them in? Um... I provide my VIP card as guarantee that they won't cause any trouble, okay? No, I can't break the rules. Please go home if you don't have the card. Well, seems like we can't go in. Sampo? Uh, forget it. Just stay cool. Let me think of something. <gasps> Got it. Okay, so we aren't going in anymore. But could you help me pick up something I left inside? The moment of betrayal. The cloud of doubt and everlasting hatred. Just mention the clown's items to Miss Thunderbolt. She'll understand what I mean. Hmm. Uh, clown? Just be patient. I'll explain everything when the time comes. Sure thing. 
I'll deliver your message to her. Please wait here. What is this guy doing? <clears throat> Here's the items you asked for. Uh, Miss Thunderbolt said these alone wouldn't be enough. She wanted you to have these broken dreams. She said, do with them as you see fit. Miss Thunderbolt is such a thoughtful person. Thank you so much. Now, we're only short of one item, which we might be able to find in an arcade machine. Coincidentally, there's one at the salon entrance. Let's get moving. I want to show you something fun. Um, okay, simple. What else items we just collected? A TV? Um, yeah. Why was this TV dumped on the side of the road? <laughs> I'm afraid you're mistaken, Miss Firefly. This is an arcade. This fine machine has a sense of aesthetics worthy of the dreamscape. It's nothing like the techie junk you see around Punk Lord. Hey, how about you try touching it and see what happens? Uh... Uh, why don't you try yourself? I've been cautious. I want to let you enjoy this first-hand experience. <laughs> I've been course, careful, you it's know. It's just a suggestion. If you aren't up for it, I, I'll do it myself. The two almost certainly turns their gaze towards you, or perhaps more precisely, it was three of them, including your guys. The guys with the trembling, oversized nose and sunglasses on the screen. You know it's time to make a choice. So, do you want to make a choice to touch the turn to see what a good event might unfold? <gasps> Touch it! The, you take a deep breath, close your eyes, muster great courage, and absorb out the way as three including box. You reach out in the sussy screen before you. Okay, time to grab the TV. It's morphin' time! Oh, I'm just. Oh my! Wait, what? Why did you turn into this thing? I'm a monkey! <laughs> God damn, you guys are tall. <laughs> you just want to say this, but somehow you attract them to a ch certain cartoon character. Your name is Hano, a candy and ticker figure, a lover of your hat and leader of the wolf werewolf from um, Pericone's famous long form cartoon, Clocky. You're also the mascot of the Bloodhound family. You silently protect. The piece of Dreamville. According to your character trait, you can only make a cool good note as your response right now. Uh, uh, let's let I grunt. That sounds cool. You make it extremely cool grunt. Man, it really is a cool. You look so cool. You got swag now, pal. So, how did he turn into that? Oh, ho, ho, ho. you don't get it, do you? Well, she was sucked into the TV just now and swapped bodies with Hanu. Hold on, let me take a closer look. Look! The title of this game is Hanu's Adventure. According to the plot synopsis, you have been shrunken down by one of Stone's devices. You will embark on an epic adventure to rescue Dreamville with your miniature body. Now, if you want to return to your normal size, you have to do everything that Hanu has done in the cartoon series. Or... You can just touch this TV. Uh, touch the TV would be easier. Uh, I wouldn't go. I'm not going to take you at the woods again, bitch. Okay, I said that. You really want to apply to your old friend in rage, but in the current state, is the best you can jump into strike his knees. Additionally, you kill the thing would not probably such an action from you. Right now, you can only emit a cold go and actually respond. Uh, fine. What do I need to do? Okay, you quickly understand the decision and decide to ask your old friend about the action you should take next. But your character sign doesn't permit you to touch your things. You can only make a cool girl in response right now. Uh, how do you know that? We well, don't you actually find out how you got this, but your character sign just just Ah, uh, same thing. Ooh, here it says, enter the door to start your adventure. You have to climb inside from there to start your challenge, pal. We'll cheer you on. <laughs> of course we will. Good luck! <sighs> Thank you, I'm a little boy. Clock Studio has designed an arcade game in Pernacoria's dreamscape. Able to let the guests play the cartoon character Hano through the transform device and experience a malicious adventure in the corner of the dreamscape. 
In the story of Hanos of Adventure, he was made smaller by Boss Stone, strange device. He then has experienced a great adventure with a small boy and taken by the treasure Boss Stone took from the town. A pair of wolf shot bars are hidden under hollow sunkers. Use the buttons to activate his hollow version to observe the tools that can be utilized and try to find a hidden treasure. Where are they? Ooh, I'm so tiny! Look at me! Can I look under your skirt? I, it's not really though. <laughs> I can see your underwear! Only a little bit! Don't question why I did that. Time to move to enter. <laughs> I finally caught you, you little Hanu! Oh, look how small you've become. You won't be able to as- <laughs> Your way is blocked. How pity. <laughs> There's a huge secret that I would never tell you. Okay. Can't do anything about that, so I'm gonna move forward. Oh. No form? Oh, back to being a sexy wife! <laughs> what up, bitch? Boom! Oh, I hate my mouth for revealing my secret. Get through the walls! Black song goes like, ah, Help me, tell me, Trill, because I'm stuck! Don't touch my boobs, okay? I'm gonna beat your ass if you do that. Can I hit it from here, though? Huh. Doesn't seem like it, so back to being small boy again. No! Oh well. Alright, time to forward, being the little one. Oh, someone's in here. Well, can you get- Yeah, you could. Okay, that's funny. <laughs> it's so funny, Chip. Are you here to save me? The elder gun so close down. Uh, Chip? Chip, 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 Chip! You can't talk out of all! Forget it, thank you, Chip. I'm leaving now. I'm sorry? I can't speak English? In the states of mind? Ooh, the chest of you, though. Ooh, using the puzzle walker by built by the organ bird. How can quickly strip between the end of the different walkways to otherwise equips? Oh, so teleport. Oh, this is like hmm, how you say getting impact version. Hey, we got some treasure just here. Okay, someone's blocking the way, isn't it? Yeah, that just is floating. Back to be a hot mama. There you go. Huh. Boom! And the chest. Huh, so what was was doing now? I just went around and circles like... I'm supposed to go up there? Oh, okay, I see. Okay, turn back. If this is real, I would do this. It looks fun, if you ask me. Um, I'm gonna guess you go from here to go up there? Can I? Thank you for that. Oh, nice. Anything else? No crap! You foiled my plan again and taken the treasure I worked so hard to snatch away from other people. Fine. I'll admit it. You rescued Dreamville once again. But you just wait. I'll be back. Who cares if I go on over and you find yourself at the end of the box stones maze? Oh, I'm back. Where I just came from. Okay. Hey, I'm back to normal. Gotta touch this. Turn back to human. Oh! My boobs! Oh, so squishy. Oh, I'm back to being human. I'm gonna slap you, yeah. being a bitch. Alright, Sampo, what do you want? You're back. <sighs> Are you alright? I wanted to see you underneath, but all well. Do you have anything to say, Sampo? Look at that! You did great! This is the proverbial moment of freedom! You have earned it! Now that we've got everything we need, we just need to go into a dream. <gasps> just follow me! <laughs> You're about to experience the real fun! Uh, what now? We're going to that place again? I'm guessing. Huh, wait. So, if that's above... Oh, it is. Okay! I just teleported. We were here before. Who we were doing this again for the second time, maybe? Dr. Edward. Welcome to Dreamscape Sales Store. Dr. Edward, that's your son. The trailblazer of the Astral Express. Here we are again. 
Huh? Nice and you've got two friends with you. Bless you, my fun. Hello, Edward. I'd like my friends to try something fun, if you know what I mean. I'll be my guest. Dr. Edward welcomes anyone who's ready for some excitement. How about we use your dreamscapes? A superb idea, sir. Let's do it. The one from last night would be perfect. Um, what's going on? This is a service we offer to our long-time customers. You can submit dreams you've recently had to me. With relevant emotion prototypes, I'll be able to turn them into customized dream bubbles that can be experienced repeatedly. Hmm. Any dreams we want? Exactly! Looks like you've got the picture. You've probably woken up from a dream one time and wished you could just go back to dreaming it, right? A dream I wished I could have continued after waking up. Miss Firefly, I admire your eagerness. But please be patient. Allow me to use my dream as a demonstration. I trust you have prepared all the necessary materials. Please. Oh, wait, all of them. Your location is a pleasure. The retrieval is complete. Calibrate the memoria and generate the dream bubble. Oh, here we go. It's ready. Please close your eyes and rest your forehead against the dream. Jump on in, friend. I wish you a pleasant time. Okay. Where am I? Um, where am uh, I? Where's this? Is this the clinic in the Bellabog underworld? Why is it empty? What's going on? Well, is everyone? This is a surprise that will be revealed later. You have to remember, in a dream, Anything is possible. Huh? Oh, no need to be hasty now. You should take a moment to get used to the feeling of being in a dream within a dream. Okay. Huh. Why am I here? Is this another note? Spirit, become the god bitch king. Through the chest bag, it has long been broken. Uh. What do you mean by this? Oh, I have no idea. I didn't come here when I had this dream. Stop nitpicking the details. If you ask me, I'd say you should take a look outside, but don't get frightened by what you say. Um, okay. I guess. Leave the doorway. Huh? What? <laughs> what the hell? Trash cans? What? What is happening? Uh, what are the trash cans everywhere? What? What's English? Uh, Satana, are you related to Natasha? They have dogs. If you're simply Hong Kong impact that now, sudden. Hmm. Are you saying you want me to rely you all together? I think that's what she means. Hmm. Deal? Uh. But I'm not going to say anything. Like, motherfucker. Dr. Edward said he didn't have time to make any alternative storylines. Just accept it. Who's up, but ta? How about a da 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 da? And I would do 
Why speak like that? Obtain the song sounds so goofy now. So what do we do now? Beautiful can, seeds can, wise can. The golden ones are you what? So, um, so what do we do? Talk to these people? They just need to quietly. The lead has clipped me faded painting. In the middle of the of Wadu's trash, a quick slight always snatched its head as the struggle to memorize the nothing number. Uh, well, you're counting trash. I need proof of trust. I think I was the one talking actually, not these guys. Um, okay. First can. But so trust could trust can hold. Kyozy appears you open the lid to first try skin. Unfortunately, it doesn't need the difference. Maybe it doesn't you know, want time to attend these details. Okay, Make that's. E! Um, sorry! I was blessing that there was a comic book inside the trash can. This page is torn and damaged. It tells of an adventure. Talavov was once a boy trash can. With the violence, violence and willpower, is defeat a cockle junk monster and save a home from his monster's maw. In order to repay Talavov, that he wouldn't turn himself into a Treskin. This is actually a whole story. A what? Okay, you seem to be unexpected. It truly says, lie inside the Treskin. Look back at you. Die, woman of Pokemon. It's time to buy the people of the menace. Use it back to tell the kind of thing to I'm fighting this day? Oh my god. What the hell? Box 2? We got a problem. I don't have Chili or Mr. Yang on the spot. I don't know if Buzz is gonna be here. Didn't hurt. Okay, Capcom is gonna go ass kick, so I better With shield her first. There we go. That's one down. Chest code. Beautiful. Now, with these guys, I should stand do still. Go. I attack one by one actually to be safe and sorry, you know. Just to be safe and sorry. Good times never last. Go, Kafka. Time to say bye. Boom. Boom. Nice, you exploded. Oh, the other one. Oh, you almost exploded. Oh, you exploded now. Yeah, that's my strategy. Why are you kicking down my wife? Oh, look, you're muscular. This is hilarious. We'll find a stress again. Ouch! Damn! You have the worst luck running into me. Okay, you need to again. I'm gonna hit you. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Naughty children, don't let here comes get the Kefka. Thanks. You're too good to me. You're Okay, go Black Swan. Memories are ever changing. Beneath the silent waters lies an endless abyss. Yeah, choke that trash can. <laughs> That's it? <laughs> you just walked off. Damn, you just walked off. Like, okay, you're done. You're past. At the loud boom, probably crisis has ended. The world is once again peaceful, and the trash king who has endured part over those of video has turned to his slumber. Thank you, nameless. What? Okay. Okay, that's one down. Uh, what if I talk to this one next? Eh? Oh, we don't speak now, mind. Is it one of you guys? Okay. Do each understand each other? How can you about the certain matter? Ah. 
Is that pian side or is that kam side? So, what is your choice? Ugh. Split go and trash into three and dispute everything. Lee. If I was to watch gate of three, you basically just split the golden trash. Not even the clock your pizza can be divided into even oh, Papa do. Ooh, I chose the wise thing to say. So do I talk to you since you're golden? No, I don't. Huh. So if it's not you, then I'm gonna guess it's this one next then. Wait, there's a golden one here apparently. There's a normal looking trash can. How magical. A kill of trash can actually have an ordinary trash can. This is a little opportunity. Do you wish to do something about it? Uh, Kick it! Adventure does not serve as behavior. In regular composition, you probably have to pick up a place of Holly or whatever. This is a dreamscape, so who cares? You can feel a foot impaired in can not bam. Open the trash can. The trash can is no longer just a trash can. It is now a trash can with arms and legs. <laughs> Uh, you talk like a beautiful, you talk like a night of beauty. Ma, ma, kana, tata. Tana, motona, ma. Nata, kana, ha. Na, tata, no, tata. Toka, ma, tata, ha, tata, tata. <laughs> then send with me against Talibon. I finally collected three proofs of trust. Let's go back and deliver them? I mean, can I tell these guys? Hmm. Kick the door. Strange. You haven't done anything, but the door opens slowly. It turns out this is an ultra sensitive door. You just can't seem stressed out. You watch the dress can exchange cut into the treasure trove, tearing open bags out of the bags of garbage and pouring the contents into those torso. I got an extra one! <laughs> um, okay, now I got like four apparently. Here you go. Okay, what's next? What is happening here? Oh my. Oh my is god. Is this where the final battle will take place? Not sure how I feel about this. Me either. Such a tragic scene. <laughs> a tragic scene. Didn't they say the garbage king would wait for me here? Have I been set up? Maybe. Sampo! <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh my god! What is going on? So is Sampo? Is Sampo the one? This game is ridiculous. I just like it. I love how it is though. Bo does Jojo button all of a sudden. Hey, wait! What kind of nonsense is this? 
Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, exactly. What the hell is this that just happened? That's ridiculous, though. We just woke up like... Huh? Sapo, what was that? A bummer. I was really looking forward to seeing how our friend was going to overthrow the Garbage King. I usually finish him off with the one punch man move. What a huge pity. Such a meaningful dream came to an abrupt halt because of Miss Firefly. I was looking forward to seeing your face when the truth dawned on you. Mm. Uh, is this a real dream of trying to hit at something hidden in the meeting? Hint at? No, more like reveal. Don't you want to find out the truth behind the dream? Don't let all that pretty scenery in the dream world distract you from your goal. As soon as you get complacent, you lose sight of the truth. Don't you think this dream bubble looks really similar to modern day Penacone? A small stage is crowded with a bunch of scheming people. None of them want to be exposed under the spotlight, so they all push you to the front. You're not at home anymore, kid. You wandered into the depths of the unknown. Let me put it to you straight. Don't let yourself get enticed by that glowing light. I'm gonna be very disappointed if you get bamboozled by the likes of them. Hmm. Ugh, a glowing light. Is that girl still here? She claims to be a local, but doesn't know how this world works. All she's got is street smarts. Who exactly is she? You don't find her the least bit suspicious? You oh, you. hurry up and confront her if you have any questions. Don't let her off scot-free. <laughs> See you around, pal. Don't let me down. Um, what did Sampo mean? Is Firefly hiding something? I don't think so. I must find her and demand an explanation from her. She shouldn't be too far off. Hold up. What is this? You find her standing in front of the 18 to look someone in front of the wall. The other machine looks busy. Despite our full credit, it stands quite in this place. Try to withdraw some coins. You have to button upon the center protocol. There's an interview, but, but something seems to be stuck in the dot. Stop it from spilling anything out. It looks like you won't be getting the cash through the company away. <gasps> Fuck! Oh well. Alright. She's standing right there. I poke her ass. Hello! The girl turned to her body sideways, getting to the distance. As is fanning your gaze. After a moment pause, she finally turned back and softly picks. I'm sorry. Uh... Uh, you don't have to apologize. I don't find you sus. <laughs> Thank you. There are things... I'm hiding from you. I'm not a local. And there's a reason why the Bloodhound family is after me. I also have my own purpose for joining you on your journey. <laughs> but still, I appreciate your help. I mean it from the bottom of my heart, and, and my admiration for the Nameless is also genuine. You guys have been to a lot of worlds, met people from all walks of life, and experienced all sorts of things. Every day is a new beginning for you guys. Mm, you can board the Astral Express too. <sighs> can I bring you one more place? It isn't another tourist attraction. It's my very own secret base, and I'll do my best to tell you everything I know when we get there. Hmm. Hmm. So sure, I believe you. Thanks. Okay, dearest customer, who's texting me out of all things? Thank you for experience that James came to game on adventures brought by Clock Studio. We hope you have a joyous experience. Please let us know how you would you rate your game experience. One, great. Two, good. Please mobile record is looking for response. Uh, one. Shoy, thank you for your feedback. You wish to put in time to dreams then. Clock Studio has appeared a great number of clans with war ever inside the game scene, as well as the limited edition Hard No Adventures book. Storybook, I mean. However, please be aware if you have any special content related to cartoon characters such as Clocky, Brother Hanu, Bar Story, etc., should have appeared inside the storybook, you are advised to start reading and reading the book. Um. What happens if I read it? If you save me to read it, I won't be put behind bars to this, will I? The current answers are in accordance with Clock Studio customer service guidelines. However, um, in order to see that you don't encounter anything unexpected within the dreamscape, please make sure to honor this warning. If you can't just listen to the suggestion, you'll have to join for a dream adventure. I hope that you'll 
great great happens inside the costume world we have created and collected all right i'm following you now take to one location this is possibly last episode guys Let's go this way <gasps> watch yourself girl you always guys went over huh? okay there's something Sounds like Mickey Mouse. <laughs> I mean, I know it's not, but <laughs> uh, what's going on? Did I make myself clear? Someone is dying. Please help. Wait. Can you see me? Uh, is there a problem? Mm, I I can see a clock with limbs. Can you really see me? Tick tock. Wonderful. This is awesome. There's still hope for Misha. Oops. Uh, I haven't introduced myself. My name is Clocky. Oh, Mickey Mouse! I'm a celebrity in Pentacony. My friends and I keep the peace in this small town. They are Hanu, Mr. Soda, Origami Bird, Hamster Ball Knight, and Misha. Misha is in trouble. Tick tock. Help! Help! Clocky, mm, uh, I no, Clocky. How can I help? Clocky? Uh, do you mean? You saw a cartoon character that doesn't exist in real life. <laughs> He's like, how the f He's like, how the fuck did this motherfucker don't see me? <laughs> uh, can't you see him? Um, where is he? I, I can't see him. He's right there on my face. Tick -tock. I guess I'm only visible to those with the innocence, kindness, and honesty of a child. Um, like this kid here, clad in gray. Uh, uh. She said you weren't innocent, kind, or honest. Just how so? Tick tock! Tick tock! My great friend, since you can see me, then you must be able to help me! My friend Misha is in trouble! I'm begging you to help him before it's too late! Uh, he says someone's life is in danger. Uh, is it really that bad? Well, are you gonna help this, um, clocky? That only you can see? I don't think you're lying, as anything can happen in a dream. We can just head to the place I mentioned later. Tick tock! Tick tock! Hurry up and follow me, great friend! Misha's in trouble! He's over there! Let me bring you to him! The name of Misha rings a bell to me. It's us with it too! Better check out what's going on. Come on! Chop chop! Move as fast as the hamster ball night! Over there. Yeah, that's her, that's her. Like okay. Calm down. Yeah, that Misha. Uh, everyone, please stay calm. You broke the rules, and now you're gonna have to pay the price. Punish. 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 Why are you punishing? I forgot her name. Oh fuck. What's her name again? How did it come to this? I John. How do you say her name, right? Uh, isn't that a Arjun? Uh, do you know her? See, I wasn't lying. Misha really is in trouble. Okay. Tick tock, I'm begging you, my great friend. Begging you, please help Misha. Hmm. Uh, please fill me in. What's going on first? Wait, are you talking to Clocky? Hmm. I'm really curious too. Just came. Hey, TikTok. look! I found the TikTok boy. It's all Stone's fault that things have turned out this way. I like this TikTok saying, "I'm gonna make some TikTok." Of all the low lives in Dreamville, Stone's the worst. He's a greedy man who wants to drive everyone out of Dreamville so that he can have all the precious stones to himself. He instructed his underlings to wreak havoc in the dreamscape, taking away everyone's positive emotions. Since then, the town has been filled with anxiety and disputes. We're no longer a family as the guardians of Dreamville. I can't just sit back and do nothing. By using the power of clockwork, I can direct the flow of positive emotions in the dreamscape back into people's hearts. That way, everyone can patch up their differences and get along again. My great friend, I require your assistance. 
I have a feeling you'll be able to master the power of clockwork. After all, you're the special one who can see me. Also, you're a new visitor to this world, which means we have the element of surprise. If you take action now, we can catch him off guard. Okay. Uh, what is clockwork? Here, I'll show you. First, close your eyes. Okay. Tick-tock. Now, our minds have merged into one. She looks nervous. Can you feel an energy surging through your body? Oh, oh yeah. Clockwork on that cranky gangster boss and inject good emotions into him. Then we'll have one. Please Can I just kill him? That you should never use clockwork with malicious intent. We're the guardians of Dreamville, after all. Tick tock. Okay. Time to use the gangster boss. Why you call that, anyways? Mind your own business, lad. I have to let that lady there know she's messed with the wrong person. But that's my hose. Both of them. Well, that's a boy, so <laughs> he counts too. Here comes the clockwork. Wait, what? What are we doing? I guess we're, I guess we're doing this. <laughs> Use your clockwork to tune the... Oh, let's not make a mouse with this one. Use your clockwork to tune this boss in the Mortal's night. Follow me, man. Your cover is your TikTok. Okay, I'm clicking. Uh, uh, let's make him sound like a bitch. <laughs> what does that look like? What is it? He looks sad. <laughs> Making him sound like I'm saying go. I'm just harassing a bitch. I wanna see. Oh goodness! Did you make him cry? Yes. Uh. <laughs> I saw a doll and got it moving. Great. It means you've mastered the art of clockwork. <laughs> Oh, what's wrong with the boss? Oh, he's crying so hard. Even I, the guardian of Dreamville, am nearly moved to tears. <laughs> oh, is he blah? What the hell? Blah! Quite the water will you, a big boy now. <laughs> I, I thought about my mother on my home planet. What do we do now? What do we do now? Whoa! Things are turning into a mess. But then again, maybe now is a good chance to ask them to leave? Mm. Mm, my friend, why don't you go in? You're right. Gang, you're dismissed. I need to be... I need to be alone for a while. Yes, boss. Oh boy. We meet again. Are you the one who helped settle everything down here? Misha, are you acquainted with this great friend of mine? He's an esteemed guest whom I befriended recently. I told you about him before. Does it ring a bell? Oh, it's him! Anyway, thanks a lot. If you hadn't gotten here in time, whew, I would have been in a real mess. Oh, how about I pick like, anything else though? <sighs> Thank you. I'm surprised we get to see each other again so soon. Hmm. Uh, no need to thank me. It's the least I can do. About all the commotion just now? I heard a bunch of masked fools were causing a ruckus on the streets. I happened to be passing through, got stopped for questioning, and there were some misunderstandings along the way. Anyway, I owe you another one. Is this lady uh, your friend too? <laughs> well,. We've only met each other once before, but he has a kind soul for helping me at the hotel. It's my pleasure to meet you, beautiful lady. The beautiful lady? By the way, what did you do to that man earlier? It was like someone took him on an emotional roller coaster. I was wondering about that too. What happened back there exactly? Hmm. Hmm, Clocky taught me some clockwork. That's right! It was me! Clocky! Of course, you played a big part too. Without you doing the clockwork, Dreamville would have been in some real trouble. Clocky? Yes, that cartoon character. I think he's shown up in reality, I mean in the dreamscape. I don't really know how a cartoon character could show up around here. 
But according to our friend here, only honest people with childlike innocence can see him. <sighs> It seems like I'm too old to qualify for that. If Clucky really exists, I can explain a lot of things. Huh. Can you see me too? I can feel the presence of something inexplicable next to you. But it's a shame that I can't communicate with him like you can. We can both perceive these extraordinary things in the dream. Probably due to our ability to react to memoria. But you're more attuned to it than I am. I thought your heightened perception was caused by something the elegant memo keeper might have left in your mind. Now it seems to me there are many more special beings like her in this dream. Hmm. Uh, the elegant memo keeper? Shortly after we parted ways, I felt someone's spying eyes on me. I looked in the mirror and spotted a lady wearing a black veil. We had a deep conversation, but... I won't bore you with the details. Hmm, so the way text bro is just giving us a hint or something else. It's a shame that I forgot to ask her for her name. I only know that she's from the Garden of Recollection. Garden of Recollection? <gasps> is that the group that serves the Eon of Remembrance? Exactly. They traverse freely between different worlds as mimetic entities and are only visible to certain people. Doesn't she sound very much like that clocky you saw? After all, it is a grand event held by the family. The guest list could be a lot longer than we imagine. Once again, thank you for being kind to me. I wish you a great time in the dream, and I shall not interrupt your date. What? No, we're not on a date. Ah, uh, Marsh will be so jealous. I mean, I don't know if many of the main kills like any of the girls. I don't know. <laughs> That's a joke, by the way, but okay. She's gone. Well, shall we? I'll let you get back to your beeswax. Thanks, my great friend. I really appreciate your help. The Nameless are indeed a bunch of talented people. May our paths cross again. May our paths cross again. Tick tock. You saying tick tock, boy? That's the clock. I hope that Misha is a very invisible friend again. You know not use a clock will go charge in someone's emotion. Different emotions bring different surprises. You just call if anyone will clock with their hands. When you get the chance, make sure you try out the measure you need. Okay, um where is she? Oh, she's over. Huh. Gonna, oh, that could have just killed me. Ah, oh, set the side. Then we go around. Oh, I should just teleport. Oh, that's too far away. I take it back. Okay, going around to the next side. Oh, uh, but is that child gonna fall off if he keeps jumping on that? I don't even know what that's gonna do. So there's a secret spot she wants to show me. What's the big deal with that, actually? Oh, Sorry. I I'm afraid we need to take the pinball machine to reach this place. You go first. I'll yeah. be right behind you. No big deal. Secret spot, you say? Um... Where exactly? Is it this? Her secret stronghold is a... a cafe? I mean... Here. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, maybe grab it? Here we are. This is the place. Mm. Uh, this place looks mighty fine. No, uh, it isn't. This is. What a... Uh, what a beautiful manhole cover. Yes, it's right inside. Hmm, do you want me to crawl in there? Let me show you how to do it. It's going to be very dark at first, so you'll have to stay close to me. Um... <sighs> oh, who's that? Fox hey, woman. let me ask you something. Is following girls around like a lost puppy your way of getting their attention? You've been doing this for nearly half a system hour. To be more precise, it's been 45 minutes. Oh, you're back. Time sure flies when you're having fun, doesn't it? <sighs> Spare me. Beautiful eyes, though. Are you from Sigonia? Need another hint? I'm an Avgen. As in honey. My eyes might not be as pretty as yours, but there's no problem with my vision. You Sigonians are notorious throughout the entire universe. Liars. 
thieves, social manipulators, wolves in sheep's clothing. You're really living up to the reputation. I say, you belong to the space under the manhole cover. Not in a dream. There's one right over there. Off you go. I'll pass. The gloomy shade of a place like that just wouldn't go with my vibe. Dreamville is frivolous, vain, and flashy. And that suits me just fine. Also, it never rains here. My outfit is too expensive to be exposed to the elements. Cut it out and go home, you slick talker. We are fools, but we aren't stupid. We aren't interested in playing the friend game with the lapdogs of the IPC. <laughs> really? You've never been friends with anyone from the IPC? Do you think I know nothing about the history of Penacony? Don't drag me into your banal office politics! Fool, you've been left with no choice since the moment you accepted the invitation to be here. You better pick a side while you have the chance. Or else you'll end up losing everything. You sound very sure of yourself. Looks like you've already convinced that chicken wing boy from the family. How did you do it, little peacock? Did you strip yourself naked? Apologize to him on your knees? And promise that the IPC would never harm Penacony? Friends? Oh, please. You guys only treat others as your bargaining chips. Oh, what's wrong with chips? In any gamble, the only players that will never be on the losing side are the chips. My friends from the Garden of Recollection and the Astral Express are all smart enough to understand that. But the smarter ones wouldn't have joined the game in the first place. See? I'm smarter. Listen, little peacock. You've been invited by the tavern before, too. If you want the masked fools to get on board, you need to figure out what it is the laughter wants. Here's a hint for you. Since you can't convince anyone, why don't you find a rock to be friends with? At least a rock won't be able to refute your arguments. <laughs> so long. Thanks. I'll keep your advice in mind. <sighs> What a pain in the neck. I guess I'll have to meet with the family again. Hmm. Anyways, um, back to me. What's going on with this guy? Here. Where am I in this place? Oh, okay. Oh, what am I doing? Hold on, let me check the map real quick. So, this is called the Dream Edge. Oh, interesting. Okay. And that's the exit. Okay. Now let's follow you around before we... We're almost there. The appeal around, so... Hmm... Oh, it's open, okay. Oy, hey! Dreams are supposed to be confusing. Oh, okay. Look! This place is breathtaking, isn't it? Guests aren't allowed here, so... We have to be careful not to get caught. Don't worry! This place isn't dangerous, just... Um... Think of this as the border of Golden Hour. The family is still building and remodeling the dreamscape beyond here. My secret stronghold is in this area. Let's sneak inside. Huh. Before anything... I'm gonna grab this. What the golden heads? Dr. Wisher is like silver or white, you could say. Yes, Hartsbill. <clears throat> Excuse me, there's a construction site ahead. Unauthorized personnel are not allowed in. Drat! We're caught right away. Hmm. Uh, fine. We'll head back. Let me try. Could you... Uh, please make an exception? We're not gonna cause any trouble. Uh, not a chance. Our boss made it clear that only the Dreamers are allowed here. He won't budge. Hmm. We know Galaga. Who? Eh, never heard of him. I wouldn't let you in, even if the Dream Master were here. None of your tricks are going to work. Please do yourself and me a favor and go home. <sighs> Seems like you won't give in. Mm, let me think of another way. Perhaps Clocky's 
clocky power trick can come in handy? Uh, this doesn't count as malicious intent, right? No. Oh, well, here we go. Activate clocky None of your powers. Are going to work. Please do yourself and me a favor and go home. Hmm. The call is minutes before you appears in put. Perhaps you need to pull up a bit. Try reading his inner thoughts. Oh, wait. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see. Let's make him happy. Alright, here we go. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Uh Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! What's so funny? <laughs> okay, buddy, what's got into you? I feel like uh, I'm on cloud nine. Ooh, can you feel it? Is this is wild? It feels like I just downed ten bottles of Apocalypse Soul Glad in one gulp and spent an entire day at the Dreamscape sales store. Oh, if Mia were here. We would sing a song together. Oh, I'm sure she would understand how I feel. I can hardly contain this palpable excitement. Oh, I'd like to invite you to dance with me, handsome. Right here, right now. Uh, will this enough I dance with you? Oh, no way. Rules are rules. It's totally fine if you want to turn me down. This crazy mood and this pounding heart are just what I need. I, I wish, I wish it would last forever. Still, I won't let you guys in because it's my duty to stop you. He really is a man of principle. As soon as we can cause about Mario and Prince, perhaps we pull him a little bit. Okay, time to get all bitchy. What's that look like, by the way? How many times do I have to repeat myself? Unauthorized personnel are not allowed at the construction site. Oh fuck, that didn't look. Ugh. Do you two really want to stay here and test my patience? You're gonna regret it. Come on, let's fight. Ugh, you're asking for it. Oh, and I wouldn't be so cocky if I were you. I deal with punks like you all the time. You fear for nothing just because you're young and energetic. You idle away your time every day, going around, stirring up trouble. You contribute nothing to society. Let me help you spoiled brats learn the hard way. Go, Sweet Dreams Troop! Teach them a lesson! There we go. Oh, what's the- Oh, that's Black Swan. I'm blocking away. Hey, it's those guys again. We got Black Swan, so she's doing that. You better all die! Hey, yo! Why do you do that? The net is strong. That's okay. I'm okay. Okay, we can strike. That's fine. Relax. I can be so happy. This can be so funny. The seal of ill fate descends. Naughty children, don't let chill. You're in bad shape. May as well kill them all. Hmm. Middle. <laughs> okay, that's good. I told you I could fight. Oh, I get a shield, Kafka. Right there, while I give you a present. Flo's HP will always get try hard the shields first. Check out this awesome move. <laughs> okay, you're gone. Huh. Stand still. <laughs> that favor the vigor. Okay, now take you down. Here. Oh, you're gone. Damn, you saw like sold us. It's like if you die, the soda pops exploded. That's so funny. Oh, oh, darn it! I can't believe I've lost! Uh, is this Is this the power of youth? If I'd had that power back then, would we have ended up differently, Mia? Alright. Uh, you can go in. As the winner here. Yeah. You deserve it. Seems like he's taking this winning and losing thing a little too seriously. <laughs> well, at least we finally get to go through. Never imagined that's how we'd end up getting past the guard. <laughs> Hold on. That trick of Clocky's really is amazing. 
Let me look up here first real quick. Oh, the sign. Sounds like a nightmare. Hold on a sec. Is this any chest around here? Before I move on to anything? Oh, okay, you know, I'm okay. Yeah, there's a chest here. Let me grab this. That's nice. Okay. Now you only has pass. Uh -huh, too bad. Let's see. So <gasps> enemies. Oh, okay. I'm gonna pass by you because you're not looking. And the one that's falling around like an idiot won't even see me. I mean, if he does, it doesn't matter. The path ends here. For the rest of the way, we need to borrow the dreamer's tools. Hmm. What happens next is going to blow your mind. Oh my! Look at that. <gasps> it's like she's about to fall down. Look at that. Well, kind of. Okay, moving on. Float down, dream of I. Okay, what? I think the dream eye allows you to switch to, into the dreamway's view. In this mode, disconnected paths, or uh, those without display will be connected to the credible way. Click the button to switch between observe mode and action mode. Observe mode provides additional information about the scene, while action mode grants characters' movements and interactions. In the dream wave of view, your character's movements is limited within the screen boundaries. To move beyond these boundaries, you need to deactivate the dream eye. Enter the dream eye to enter the exit of the dream world view. Oh, I'm gonna be the last one. Okay. Different points in space are linked together? Now we can go to the other side. This is how the Nightingale family repairs the dreamscape. Fascinating, isn't it? Hmm, yeah. Let me grab this. Hold up, I don't open my thing yet. Leon is open quick. Okay, so the plan of the Golden Hour can provide our mail and ball the fool, ignoring whether the such talk such should be discussed on stage at all. But no pleasures can make the thing of united with old friends. Pull out by the colors of unlabeled blue. The impressions of his poses for you are. Hmm. Womanizing isn't bad. Okay, encountering Shampoo again has triggered a sense of nostalgia inside you. Seems like you're the nostalgic type. Indeed, what you experienced together on that snow covered planet was enough to be regarded as true comrades. Now, we've got a lot of these to put down, so I'm gonna put these down for extra rewards. That's one down. Music. That's number two. And then, uh, tokens? I mean, surely? How oh, he says tokens. <gasps> Money! Ooh, hilarious. Balls. Um, let's put you right here because why not? Another ball pit. And then one more item we got. Then we got the ball pit. And we got 10%, which is 100%. Now go to my character selections. Any more? Huh, how come there's any more? The exclamation point though, there's like... I mean there is though. A valid cartoon figure appears before you. A pity that you can't be a fan by the clockwork fantasize. But interests can always be slowly neutral, right? Hmm... Its abilities are incredible. A living cartoon killer has manifested right before you and has ever given you much power. It's novel and powerful and also accompanied by... A bit of moral agability. Thankfully, you're someone's with high morals. It won't mess with other people's feelings on the roof, right? Yeah, I got some of these stickers to put down, so why not? Now I'll put you on stage because you're the main one. Is that, uh huh? Me on the stage. Now let's put you. You like Friends of Freddy's character next to each other. Put you. Buddy. Oh. It looks like uh Monty. Yeah, leave it alone. I heal that's not a chest, okay. Oh boy, there are enemies heal. Like actual enemies yeah. heal. Okay, hit that. Now we're gonna we go to can use the building materials that are floating around in the air. Okay, interact with the device highlights and color models and their technology. Use injected upwards to rotate or move. The model along was set to uh, Oh, have you seen it? Move the module. Thanks for the way. Only one? Not coming more! That's a whip off. Like, really? Now, yeah, before we move forward, um, is there something here? Like a chest? Oh, yeah, there is. 
Hey, nice. Got some chests to find. Okay, now let me just start the dream mode again. Move the model. There's an enemy blocking my way. Like stepping on planks, floating on water. I'm gonna go pass by you. I don't care about you. Yeah, let me get just first. Okay. We can get to the rooftop of the opposite building from here, but it requires a device. I remember it's hidden here. Hmm. Okay, let me do this first. Puzzle Jigme holds dream jogs. Jigsaws may appear anywhere in Pentacony. Completing the jigsaw puzzle will make an object with an appearance in the dreamscape. Drag jigsaw pieces and place them in the correct position within the frame. Click jigsaw pieces to rotate them in the correct angle. Once the puzzle is complete, the object within will appear in the dreamscape. Hmm. This looks obvious. Even this one and this one. Uh, oh, I meant to rotate this? Um, there you go. Bam! And it comes out just like that! No matter how many times I've seen it, it still looks magical. Okay, we'll take the module. Wait a minute. Was there something... Oh, uh, that seems... Huh, that seems useless to get over there. Okay, we'll go this way. Oh, it's being guarded by dogs! But I don't care! I don't want to deal with them! Unless they hit me first, then I don't know what to do about- <gasps> What is that chasing me?! Leave me alone! Yeah, 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 go back up, back up, back up, back up! Huh. There's a chest right there, and I'm gonna risk it. I just want the chest! I just want the chest! I don't want to fight you guys! I just want to get to this- Oh, you're trying to clap my ass? Hell no! Huh. Hey, look at this! We found another one. It's like the bone machine pit. Okay, um... We'll take that way and we'll take. Uh, no, close. Yeah, you close too. Voltate, voltate. What is this? Like, shouldn't it be voltated or something? Oh, is this meant to be voltated too? Um, hold up. That doesn't seem right. Because if I'm supposed to. Oh, wait, I see, actually. That doesn't seem right. Like, are we supposed to go up there or something? That doesn't seem right. Oh, I didn't see that. I was like, huh? Guess I'm a blind spot when I find that one. Oh, okay. Once we're out of here, I'm like done with this episode. Boy, after this, I'm done with the episode. So many bubbles yes. balloon to pops. Huh. I'm gonna follow those because why not? They contain extra credit, so why not? I'll deal with you later. Or off camera. Is Look, this a spot? That's the Pentacony Grand Theater over there. Huh. Why is this glowing? It radiates oh. dazzling light perpetually. Just like this glamorous dream. I suppose everyone who likes to bask in the light will be drawn to that kind of warmth. Like countless fireflies chasing the fire. Let's go. Half the journey is still ahead of us. Half the journey is still ahead of us? Oh my god, how much... How far is this gonna be, actually? Okay, let's just keep on going, actually. This one is a little bit complicated. Hmm. I have to put on my thinking cap. Okay, um, let's just go this way then, and oh, chest over here. Oh, I shipped. Thanks for the way out, actually. Yeah, we know what we're doing. Hmm, is this I wonder here? whether I can still control the floating building materials in this. Oh, chest. Okay, thank you for that. Okay, now this is where we get out of here, don't we? Oh, my brain. Oh, my brain. The family recruited many artists, architects, and scholars from across the universe to form the team of dreamers that built the dream of Pentacony. 
These areas are not developed yet, so guests don't come here. It's not as lively as the town center here, but I relish the serene atmosphere. They don't care we're here or not. The enemies are around here. It looks so funny. They don't notice we're here. Another chest to grab. We move from that building to this building in the blink of an eye. <laughs> this would be impossible in reality. Oh, yeah. Okay. Just put it right there. But I don't care. Oh, might it be so. Why? He's sending up anyone here. They're not looking. They're not doing the job right. They're gonna be fired. It's the same routine. You've mastered it, right? Um. Uh, wait, what? Some jeans drop pieces out and see what made moves and not looking, seeing not doing the look in interaction. Father is charging to a video scatter piece to complete the puzzle. And. I'm gonna start with that one first. Oh, the blow. Oh, we're gonna fight some enemies. Okay, you know, no big deal. I don't mind doing that, actually. That one, I'll do the enemy first. Hey, wake up. Wait, why are you only electro? I mean, you are, so. Boom! Yeah, that must hurt a lot, huh? Wait, what? So, if you have a good mood, then you would. Uh... say bye. Ah, you're funny. You're gonna get killed anyways. Boom! Oh, that was quick. Who just muddled them all? Oh my god, look at this. We're just killing them. We just muddled them. There's one down. Relax. Okay, that's over. Huh. The human body is beautiful. Now we got fragility. one jigsaw party. Now the next one is some of some NPC. <sighs> what exactly went wrong? Is it because I've gone for too long without drinking Soul Glad, or because I've been working overtime for two months? Why don't I have any inspiration today? Hmm. Uh, you seem distressed. Oh, who's there? Why are there guests here? Y you know what? I don't care how you snuck in. Just leave me alone. If you prevent me from finishing my work on time, I'm gonna make you pay for it. So you need to find a way to input this dream waiver. Try his inner thoughts. Happy gear, huh? The post ML gear is missing TikToks. You can obtain a book like using emotional absorption. I feel like be a gear close by. Let's go find him. We have to find one? Hi, okay, I guess we're going to talk to this person. Hey! Excuse me, this is for a date. Hey, <laughs> you see, I thought this would be a great spot for a date, right? Check it out, isn't this a view exception? That's impressive. Got a lot of good ideas. You do. This place is a great view. You can see all the golden houses from here. Though, have you wanted to leave? We're not going to this vent dock again, are we? Oh, that, well, they got to be away. Don't think about that much stuff. Let's enjoy what we got for now. Oh, we just stole it from his ass? <laughs> That's hilarious. Don't want to fight you two. You're not even looking this way. Alright, dreamscape. What exactly? Okay, okay, chill, just chill. Heal. Let's give you a happy heal piece. You good? <laughs> I got it. What a brilliant idea it is. I must write it down on paper while it's fresh in my mind. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm sure I'll forget all the details when I wake up from sleep. Uh, there's no better time than now to put it to action. Hmm. Yeah. He wandered off, but he left behind the puzzle piece. Yeah, that's good. The evil deals missing speckled gears in the dreams that cannot be turned. However, you can obtain the card gears with your own chances by exploring the dreamscape. Pay a lot of attention to these people. You will see for general surprise once you fix all of them. Tick tock. All of them? Why is only one? Mmm. It should be like more. Like, you know. Oh, I grabbed the jigsaw. We got two to grab. Um. That's one down. Let me fix that. There you go. Impressive. Thank you, Kafka. Want a prize? I do. I want that pussy. Support guild will it appears in certain specific will gameplay. Follow support guild and finish the current operator at the distance of the current mission. Back to the black swan. 
How do I activate this? Oh my god, there's a lot of way to explore this game. Is this way different? Anyway, hold up. Any chairs? Nope, apparently not. So now let's just move to this location that we're gonna head to next. What you gonna say? Go on. Oh, I should have waited. Um, uh, wait a minute. Enemies! Um, I'll leave you alone. You didn't notice I was there. That's hilarious. Oh, there's a chest right here. Okay, I see. That's very funny. So, if it's not here, um, I'm gonna guess we're supposed to use that next to get up there next. That is my guess. We'll take the module. Um, is that good? That doesn't seem good, actually. Hmm, okay, now we head back down, I'm guessing. Will you just stay at us if there's thing coming past by you? Alright, back to the buddy. Oh, look at that. Okay, I was right, there we go. Hmm, wasn't there an enemy here before, but I guess they don't show up while I'm doing this. It is funny if you ask me. <gasps> a chest. A beautiful chest. Back to noble. Oh, finally, there won't be too many hindrances after this. Oh my God! Is it anyway there? I see it. Huh. Gonna fight that thief first? I mean, I don't mind it actually. Okay, how many chests did I find so far? Uh, fifteen out of twenty-seven. Okay, I'm trying to. I'm trying to find more as I go forward. There's a big dog. Um. This area wasn't guarded the last time I was here. Uh, half my frequent comings and goings started drawing attention. I don't think we can get around them. Knocking them out is the only way to go. Why is that a T-Rex? At long last, this baseball bat of mine has found its purpose. Let's get rid of them. How do I fight, by the way, if I see her fight style, but doesn't be out here, so. <laughs> Ooh, you tried to put me down. What did T-Rex do? One out of six? You just have been a Kafka's boobas? Oh, what about the hurt? Damn, just swing a tabby. But one mistake. Oh, great. Another walk? Watch this! I'm gonna attack you first. Stand still. Black swan with the seal of ill fate descends. Explode me. What is I do next? Four, two, and one. Spicy! Why are you screaming? Oh, I froze Memories you in the middle. Are ever changing beneath the silent waters lies an endless abyss. <laughs> yeah, choke them. Good times. That's a good damage. Time to say bye. Boom! Ooh, that's a lot more damage. Oh, that's what happens! Okay, I see how it goes. Hey, hey, Marsh, chill with that morning. Like that is taking all, but again, ill timing manifest. Hmm. So, Relax. so I'm gonna do it six more times, apparently. But why well, don't make it? So, like that, I'm guessing. Uh, can I go heal first before I move? Why can't I run? Why can't I run? Oh, come on. I'll go to the point where we're at the walk now. I mean, I think we do. Oh, 
Oh my god, okay, I guess we're gonna go... Oh, I checked it out, okay. Now I'm just jogging, just sent healing, that's what's going on. So, this is the place you wanna go before the end of the episode? Someone's... singing? Where is the sound coming from? Hmm, where exactly? Oh, huh. I that too. I'm just following Black... I'm just following Firefly as Black Swan. Is this the spot? Have you heard of this song? It's called If I Can Stop One Heart From Breaking by Robin. Oh, Her song I was singing. The dreamland from time to time as the Charmony Festival is drawing close. This spot is the closest place to the sky in the dreamscape. It's far away from the now hustle and bustle of the city and free from the bickering among the dreamers. You can feel the moment. The scenery. The people and the dreams. Without being disturbed by anyone. How beautiful. <laughs> Time is frozen at this golden hour. This golden dream shared by the fool from the tavern. And the memo keeper from the garden of recollection. The wandering ranger and the IPC ambassador. The Astral Express nameless. And me. Everyone falls asleep here equally. Regardless of our different agendas. I'm sorry. I really am a stowaway. Hmm. I never saw that coming. I think it's only right to tell you. My hometown was destroyed a long time ago. <laughs> it was probably the doing of the Legion or the Swarm, but... I I'm an interstellar refugee. Just like many of the Penaconi locals, the Harmony accepts everyone, including wanderers from afar. Family takes them in, but they don't. They don't belong here in this splendid metropolis. Some have a dream called Penicone, but some have dreams that are no different from reality. Even though everyone who comes here harbors the same motive in the beginning, and it's likewise for me. I have a wish I want to achieve so badly in the real world. But I can't. So... I want to give it a shot here. Mm, I know that feel. Entropy loss syndrome. Have you heard of this term? It's a strange condition. Those suffering from it will experience an irreversible chronic dissociation of their physical structure. This means they will slowly fade away, and the process is barely noticeable to others. You can still run, jump, and talk as usual. Everything seems normal. But then you'll start doing everything slightly slower than others. And then even slower than that. Until the lines between your body and the entire world become blurry. You won't be able to tell reality from dreams because they have all been shattered. So how can I possibly resist it? I mean, can you imagine? I can actually free myself from this icy medical cabin in this dream. I can forget about all the doctor's advice. I can listen and see and touch and think and understand whatever I want with my body. 
So although this world isn't real, this experience is priceless. Just like this moment. I'm sorry. For certain reasons, there are things I can't reveal to you yet. But there are also things you should know. I am, in fact, after the Watchmaker's legacy. But that doesn't mean we have to go our separate ways and be enemies. But at least... I really hope things don't turn out that way. Hmm. Hmm. Uh... I hope so, too. Thanks. In my dream, I saw a scorched earth and a new sapling emerging from it. It bloomed against the morning sun and it whispered to me. I still remember the question on the invitation letter. Why does life slumber? You see, Everything is possible in this land of dreams. The nightmarish past will disperse and fade away like bubbles in water, and the future that you don't want to face will never come. Why do people choose to sleep? I think it's because they're afraid to wake up from the dream. Hmm, yeah. I'm sorry. Things are getting all bleak and serious. Uh, let me see what I can do to lighten the mood. I mean, don't you have a lot of friends on the Astral Express? What would you guys do if something like this happened? Hmm. Let's see. We got a lot of options. Uh, Daniel will tell us dry jokes to deepen expression. Uh, Himiko. No. March would force us to take a selfie with her. Selfie. Selfie. Hmm. You're right. I mean, I've been here so many times, why didn't I think of taking a photo? I feel a little awkward taking it by myself. Would you like to join me? Let's commemorate this moment. Hmm, sure. I can be a little bit camera shy. <laughs> Just don't laugh at me. Here, you hold the camera. The girl hand her phone to you, her eyes filled with expectation. You take the photo, I mean phone, launch the camera app, and switch into the front face camera effortlessly. Then, extend the lead your arms, you hold the phone at the system, and show you both of you capture for the frame. Wait, let me get ready! I'm good. Let's do this. One, two, say cheese! Marsh says that. Oh, look at us! It's like we're couples, but uh, I don't know about that, actually, if you ask me. Is this it? Hello? Background? Okay, that's done. Ooh, who's texting me? What's up, what's up? Oh, having fun? Lots of fun, sure, but something feels off. It doesn't feel very weird. It's odd. I can't describe it. Hmm, there's some progress. I saw a guy when you plastic head sculpted at the arcade and walk up without doing anything. That's pretty sus. I always have some unpleasant discoveries. It's a bit complicated. It's best if we meet in face to face. Me too! Let's not jump back to where it's overdue. Let's move in my room. Do you have yeah. to go back already? <laughs> Time really flies. I feel like going back to reality and resting too. Come on, let's say goodbye at golden hour. Hmm. I mean, can we give it a hug first though before we leave? Alright guys, I'm gonna bail. Like and subscribe, I'll see you on the other side. Bye.